Hello there! It's been an awesome three years living together with my giant schnauzer in the sunny corner of Europe. And guess what? We decided that it's time to expand our family. In October we decided to welcome one more dog in our lives. This episode is all about how the puppy entered and changed our lives, about ups and downs, about the house and love that came with it. So let's start from the beginning. Alright, he is here. The very first meeting with the puppy. Please meet Sydney, this tiny handsome boy. At first he was worried of me, but snacks work their magic. It was important for me to remember that he's not going to like me or trust me. And it's a journey that takes time and patience. After dog's first meet, we went to the backyard and gave them the freedom to just be themselves and explore in their own way. I'd love to share the top three most important moments from the first week. First off, let's talk about Sydney's health. Overall, he was doing good, except for his pose. As you can see in this video and on the photo, he had some kind of weak wrist. We consulted with our vet and she prescribed some vitamins and also recommended keeping him active. I'm happy to share the head that within just a few months this issue completely disappeared. Yeah. 
the first three nights were tough. Sydney was barking and crying through the whole night, and Arnie was depressed and anxious. It was completely understandable. I worried about Arnie, and we made an extra effort to spend more quality time playing with each dog separately. We also started treating them with some special food when they are together, hoping to create more positive moments during this challenging period. The third point is around mess and endless cleaning. With Arnie it was quite a different experience and I wasn't prepared for what we got. Sydney was peeing on the floor about 10 times per day and despite the fact that we had a yard and our endless attempt to teach him to go out, it didn't work. So you can imagine the constant cleaning process we had to deal with. I didn't mention it earlier, but Arnie and Sydney are from the same breeder, but from different parents. So they share a same breed and same gender but have completely different characters. They are like water and fire. I honestly cannot imagine two Sydneys. It would be quite handful for us. Sydney has a lot of fun, energy and he is super active. While Arnie is also fun, but he is more wise and elegant. Arnie hates dirt, but Sydney couldn't care less. Arnie barks only when there is a danger, while Sydney barks whenever he feels like it or he gets excited. They are so different, yet it is a beautiful dynamic and more interest to observe them. It's worth to mention that for now they didn't fight. Most of the time it's just dogs are playing. They are getting used to each other and I am genuinely happy that we decided to add one more dog to our family. Good boy. Are you ready to go? Are you ready to go? Yay! <laughs> there are so many things left to share with you, but it is going to be in the next video. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Life with Strange Schnauzers. Your support means a lot. And I truly appreciate every comment you leave. If you have any specific ideas or topics in mind that you would like to see in the next episode, I would love to hear your suggestions in the comments below. Wishing you a fantastic week ahead and I hope to see you soon. Bye bye.